Hi guys, I'm Exactas and welcome back to another episode of Workers and Resources. This is the Soviet Republic of somewhat Soviet state of chaos. And uh, yes, what I've done in between is I've actually laid out a few more buildings over here for residential purposes. You can see uh, it's going to look pretty nice. I've kind of squeezed it in over there. So this kind of little bit of urban development piece that I, I just do enjoy doing that. So while I've got that going, uh, I might as well do a few more trees and things like that in this area, just in general. I do like a fair bit of is this. What, well, let's just see about getting some trees and stuff going on. Oh, and the one thing that I should probably do is add a little bit of monuments and stuff like that. So um, if you go to the mods and you go to monuments, what kind of monuments do we have over here? I do like um, using a fair bit of the stuff that we have. What is this? Four pillar? What is that? Oh, that's interesting. So that's actually just allowing you to uh, make sure that your rails are... Um, I believe it's to make sure your rails are straight. Anyway, it doesn't matter. I'm not going to squeeze that one in here. This is like a pavilion. So we can do a little something like that over here. So if we set that, actually, let's do that. We'll set it back in there somewhere, okay, like so. And then we'll grab ourselves a, a, a linen or two. Probably on this side instead. Yeah, so we'll do something like that. So it's a little bit of a, a nicer little area. I'm going to see about doing a bit more of that from time to time. So we'll do that. We'll squeeze it in there. This one will go in there. And at the same time, we'll also just tie this in like so. So let's um, start work on all of that. We'll get some trees up and running over here. I just go back to the trees again. And we'll just pop in the one that I've kind of gone missing here. Really, we can't squeeze in another tree um, and I thought I may as well do a couple up against the building here like so there we go so that's just gonna make these areas look a little bit nicer there's a fair bit of construction underway over here and um, this airport needs um, a fair bit more work but I think we are making progress 322 tons more of asphalt uh, what I should do is I should in fact speed things up a little bit Okay, what I also wanted to do, uh, I did in fact get our, um, this guy up and running, there's a few vehicles in there, and while I'm at it, we're probably missing a fair bit. Oh, I did um, extend this and add a few more of these for development so that we can remove some of these things into the appropriate places. Give me the open hole over there, and what I'll do is I will move you to here. Oh, I can't. So... How can I, how can I move this thing? Can I say you need to go on this guy? So I'll have to build some of them. Okay, well, interesting. Well, let's get this going then. Let's uh, um, align a few of these open holes. Oh, no, 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 no. I don't want to buy things. I want to set a blueprint. Uh, open hole. So let's do, how many of these do we need? Let's do two of them. The problem with doing that is that we have to stop it. It doesn't stop by itself. So let's get a few people to work there. We'll build a couple of those guys um, and we'll see how that goes. We are exporting vehicles fairly aggressively. Um, our money is going up nicely because we're now also exporting our nuclear fuel over here that's up and running. There's a fair bit of construction underway here, getting a road done. Um, getting this row done. I think this is going pretty slow at the moment due to the fact that um, a lot of our construction vehicles are stuck in over here, but I believe we will get through that fairly quickly. Um, we've got vehicles delivering stuff here now through our latest, um, our latest uh, distribution office over here. It's not the greatest setup just yet. We're missing a number of vehicles, so we'll probably, let's grab, uh, let's grab a few more. Uh, we've got the refrigerator and as far as we can probably take it. Let's grab another one of these. And move that in there. Okay, what I also wanted to pick up here is get um, uh, the huge... Can you... You can pick up... Do we have alcohol over here? Let's just check. I don't think we have alcohol in here. Yeah, we don't have alcohol available over here. So what we'll need to do is uh, pick up alcohol um, over here. 
So let's um, let's add this facility and say, guys, you would like us to please pick up alcohol over here instead. You can pick up your food on that side. Yeah, this is uh, busy. And I'm just checking, we have a rail line, right, that's bringing crops. Can I just quickly have a look at the crop line, the grain imports? It's only doing that. So unload, wait till unloaded. Yep. So that means um, we shouldn't have any problems um, if this thing, um, that it goes back and forth if it can't unload everything. Nice. Okay. Let's, uh, let's do a little bit of cleanup over here. Hang on, what is this? This is another plane. Let's do a little bit of cleanup over here by adding a few trees. Um, shall we do, uh, I want to try and um, do a fair bit of different kinds and styles of trees. I believe we should now be in a position where we have um, have more people um, that has access to food. We shouldn't have too many complainers anymore. Uh, sport, meat and food is like three, that's fine. Um, over here, what, do, what are you guys saying? 47 without food, honestly, and over here, what are we saying? 60 without food, hang on, let's just have another look at this. If I have a look and say food, what's going on here? There's nine tons of food available over here and there's five tons of food available here. But really, we should be able to allow, give everybody access to food. So are you out of food now? I do wonder how the whole food thing works. It doesn't actually naturally draw it in there. Okay, we're waiting on a few things to happen, but what I thought we may as well do is we may start um, building the rest of this road. Let's uh, give it a bit of a meander. I, I like the idea of giving it a bit of a meander through here because I want to make this kind of a touristy kind of area. Now, the question is, do we... Uh, now let's meander it still. Where will we go with this? Will we be um, crossing some stuff? I think that's an okay section. Let's get started on, on this section over here. Um, that'll allow us access to these stations. Mm, we'll, we will not cross the track again, I think. We'll see, leave that in place. So let's uh, let's get started on that work. That should be pretty good. We should see some alcohol arriving here soon. We've got people um, working here. Tourists were not able to um, participate in any sport. I believe we've got a pool somewhere. This is a pool. Any other sporting facilities that we would like to add here? Let's have a look. So if we go sporting, sports playgrounds, now, the question is, do we do something um, substantial? It, it wouldn't be, it wouldn't be a bad idea to start to start to look at doing maybe something like this over here. That spot there for this would be, would be really cool, actually. That would be really cool. Something, what, what is this guy? That's a pretty huge one. Um, this stadium, actually, this stadium might be even better over here. I like that stadium more so than I, I like just these open fields here. What is the difference in stats here? Maximum of 15 workers. That one is 25 workers. I like that one better. We'll get a bowling alley and all kinds of stuff. This is another stadium. What is this one? 30 workers. Is that the one we rather want here? I think that spot there for the stadium is really good. Alternatively, somewhere over here, maybe? On the waterfront? Nah. Nah. We'll have it somewhere over here. 
But I'd rather do... And then we'll do a bit of a park on this side. Yeah, that's going to be cool. Need free excavators. Okay, so we don't have excavators available in this area. Probably a good idea to start building um, some additional... This is all built, right? I was thinking we need to maybe build another construction office um, over here somewhere. Uh, this spot, um, easy access onto the highway, would be a great spot for another construction office. There's a lot of construction underway uh, uh, at the moment uh, anyway. What's going on over here? Okay, so you've done a couple of those. Let's switch over and start doing what else do we want it to do? Yeah, we can drop them there and then move them in here. Yeah, that's a bit of a bummer, really. Uh, I wanted to do some of these guys. Let's do a few of these, and then we'll do a fair bit of these again to fill up there. Um, we have fire trucks. I'll move the fire trucks over here. Oh, no, no, I had the refrigerator trucks over there. Anyway, that's going to be okay. So now what we'll do is we'll come in here and say, guys, um, please, um, ooh, actually, it's this guy. Please load up over there. Nice. And you, please load up over there. Nice. Good. Now what we'll do is we'll move these guys over. Yeah, I have to move the entire thing. So come on over here. Do we just do it like that and just leave them in there? Probably. Probably we'll just do that. Uh, there's a few of these that we still need to move also. Uh, yeah, I started building that because I wanted to, with the, with the view of getting the, the next construction office underway. So, modded construction offices. Uh, always do the big one. That's what I'm doing. Always do the big one. Now the question is, I don't, I don't want that um, to pop in over there. So I'd rather just do. This section here, and then I'll tie that one in. Oh, the other thing that we need in this general area, we don't have power here though, so we'll have to kind of see about figuring some of these things out. Um, let me grab uh, the little piece of road. We'll probably don't need that. Let's just do the uh, this one. So we'll do a little bit of this, get that going on. We need a, a fuel station somewhere over here. That's going to be a good good one, but we'll need power for the fuel station also. Okay. These guys did come in over here. They're now This depot is now all filled up. I can't unload. I believe I can't unload this, right? No space available. So I'll have to have a look, see how that uh, can potentially be working in the future. How are these guys going? Oh, construction is coming along nicely. Trees are growing. Oh, this area, mm. it's interesting. We're really struggling to get stuff built now, and I believe it's the airport. The airport is really killing us, taking so many vehicles, so many vehicles, 224. It's at least going. It is progressing. It's just taking a hell of a lot of time. It's just taking a hell of a lot of time. Each time a vehicle pops in there, it stops working. Nice. Okay, so that construction, oof, lots of construction works that's going to take ages to finish. Um, I've got some mods, so if I go in over here, um, I've got some mods, I'm not going to do it now, but I've got some, oh, mm, what? Purchase a train. I can't purchase a train because I don't have an open spot, is that, that right? So if I go purchase a train over here, oh, that's, that's US, hang on. Something burning? No, just uh, going on. Okay, here. Yeah. Uh, train, seat, tram, passenger way, track builders. So I've got a number of extras and I, and I played around with them a little bit. I, honestly, I don't know how these things properly work because they're not that impressive, to be honest. They're not that much better. Um, this one is pretty good. It seems it's pretty good. And that one seems to be pretty good. Some of these others, mm, I'm not too convinced that they are 
are as good. It, I honestly don't know how these track builders work. Do you kind of combine them with other wagons? Is that an option or doesn't that work that way? I have no idea. Can I can I potentially build a track builder, put a track builder together over here as a set? I have no idea. I have no idea. So if you've got some insight into track builders and how they work, um, that would be quite useful for us. We're making a fair bit of money now. Uh, the, sell, the selling of nuclear fuel um, is one of those things that really works well to make money. How's our UFC, uh, UF6? UF6 is underway. Got no workers here at the moment. What's going on? Oh, they are running. The trains are just getting stuck a little bit. Okay, hang on. One thing I forgot to do is do the line spacing yet again. Let's just uh, keep should make sure we do the line spacing. I do hope they bring it into the default um, with, uh, without cheating um, fairly soon. That would be would be really useful if they do that. Uh, what I'll do, I'll grab a few of these little poplars and I'll run some poplar trees up alongside this road section here. Come on, can I squeeze one? Ah, nice. And that one more? Yes. Nice, look at that. That's going to be beautiful. Uh, what I'll do is let's um, let's actually make it a fairly dense dense section here. Can I? I should be able to squeeze another. Come on. There we go. Another in there, and another in there, and one more. Oh, beautiful. That's going to be a nice little strip there. Can we? Let's go around the corner here. Uh, that's not great, but anyway, that's going to be okay. That's going to be helpful. So slowly we'll try and maneuver some of these things, make them look a little bit better. Do we have alcohol here now? Not yet. Still, we don't have alcohol. That's under construction. No alcohol over here. Um, how many tourists do we have over here? Accommodating 13 tourists. Guests without service because we don't have any people working there. Uh, that's a bit of a bummer. Can we grab a bus and in the meantime run a bus from where? We should have a bus station over here with lots of people. Yes, we do. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to set up a route. Um, let's just grab one of these buses and say, um, pop in over here, please. And then go and drop off some people over there. So you are going to pick up workers. Well, you can just pick up and drop off everybody you want. That's fine. Let's just do that and uh, make a start. Oh, all of this is done. Let's quickly see. Um, do we have people? Oh, that's filled up. That um, still needs a little bit of uh, people going in there. These still need a fair bit of people. Okay, so let's see. Where do we have people living at home? We probably need to start expanding, getting a little bit more going on. We can't get much closer than this. So I think, let's just, uh, let's just do this. There's, there's a bit of a rule of thumb here. If you look at the food production, if you take the big field, you can't get closer than the big field. Uh, so... That means we could potentially do a few more things here. We could potentially do a few more things just, just in this area, but there's so much infrastructure here that it might not really work that way, that well, if we do that. But I think a couple of more things. We'll try and squeeze a couple more things in here. Just so it's sensible. Okay, hang on, let's have a look. Where are the adults living at home? Uh, these guys, there's a fair bit of them all over the show, really. Let's grab this guy and start moving some people over. Okay, so that'll be a little bit more helpful. So we'll move a few people over there. Let's see about moving some people from over here also. Lots of people without jobs. Food is not an issue though, it seems. That was a really quick to fill up. Anyway, that's fine. That means we'll... How's our population growth going? Our deaths aren't too bad. I believe our food situation is getting better. Out of food here. This is the problem. We run out of food so quickly. Hang on. Can I... No, 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 no. Let's... Um... Let's get tons more food to come in over here. That's the idea. Fill it up. 
Yeah, I think that should be fine. I just forgot to set the limits. So we don't, really don't need that much, that much. But anyway, we'll, do, we'll keep doing this. Okay, let's, um, so we need some sporting activities over here. So maybe something like a bowling alley or we'll start building some of that. So um, sports playgrounds, yeah, a bowling alley. Oh, a bowling alley doesn't actually have a road connection. Can we squeeze it in? Mm, it's not going to work. It's not going to work. So let's grab a bowling alley over here because it doesn't have a, a road connection, all right? Let's squeeze it in here. Yeah, let's do that. I think that's going to be awesome. Do a bowling alley and maybe a gymnasium. Yeah, let's do that. We want to create a little bit of interest in this area, so let's do, let's see about uh, starting it off like that, really? Okay, cancel that section, try it again. It just doesn't want to do it, so we'll have to do it something like, well, alternatively, what we'll do is we'll Started off like this, tie it in there and get rid of that section there. Yeah, let's see how that ends up looking. So let's get cracking on the construction with that. Uh, we'll see about moving this guy out that way. Uh, these will connect up a little bit later, that's okay. How did this go? Uh, that's under construction nicely. We've got this going on. Look, 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 it's starting to look Starting to take shape, look nice, all these kind of things. Okay, airport, guys, airport, we need this airport done. How much more? 153 tons of asphalt. A lot of the vehicles have left now. So many guys working on this. This is so slow, we really, uh, everything used to go really quickly over here. Now, not so much, not so much. This is under construction. Okay, I was kind of interested in a few more spots for people to live maybe. Let's quickly get the residential pieces up and running. Yeah, it's a lot of waiting at the moment for us. A lot of waiting. So if I grab some of these, we can actually squeeze them in here. That's not bad. Okay, let's try and get them nicely aligned here. Um, I'm gonna, let's start it from this side with the, la the So we'll do one of those. Okay, and do we have a smaller one? Actually, only have the longer ones. This is a five story. This is a smaller one. Can we? I don't want to do it that way. A slightly bigger one. Ooh. Oh, that's actually a university hall. Uh, we've got one over there, right? Squeeze another one over here, maybe. I don't know. Let's, uh, let's instead see about something like this maybe. Just wondering, that's, we don't want it bigger than the other. So actually, let's just leave it as is. The two of them are gonna be just fine. And we'll see about squeezing in some other facilities over here. Yeah. So if I do this and I do that, nice. And there we go, and it's snowing. Yeah, so the idea is that we then tie that one up there, tie this one in over here, and this doesn't actually tie up here? Wow, 
Let's make sure to tie all of those together. Don't buy, pay for it. Just hook them up. Uh, what we'll do is we'll hook one up there, one up this way, one up over here, and one up over there. And we could also get this guy to cross over here. Nice, and we'll get all of those things built. There we go, get that one built too. So all of these are kind of, kind of connecting up on this side. Um, let's do a bit of this, a little bit of that. And we'll tie, mm, what I'm thinking is maybe we run it uh, on the edges here so that we create a little bit of an interesting square or something going on here. Yeah, something like that. Do it. Do it. Get that built so we'll create some kind of a square in that area that's going to be a little bit more interesting. Yes. How's our airport going? Let's have a look. Um, not a lot of workers on site. Still waiting on 110 tons of of asphalt. Let's really see what's going on with the asphalt arrangements. I also want to quickly have a look at what is going on with um, how's asphalt going. Asphalt is is not struggling too much. We have a fair... Ooh, gravel is probably our biggest concern here. But we are providing all the asphalt we need as and when it's needed. So it's not too bad. Let's quickly have a look at our... Um, now that it's winter, let's just have a quick look at what our temperatures are looking like. Oh, okay, so over here, it's getting a bit cool because we don't have, um, where is our closest, th this guy? Uh, this guy should, in fact, be able to, to deal with it, but we probably need to bring in um, a little bit of support from this side. I think that's going to be the idea. So that's something that we can start working on. Um, these are all fine. Temperatures, temperature wise, we're not struggling. Yeah, temperature-wise, we are not struggling. That's good. That's really good to see. Okay, what we probably what we need, um, I think we need just get a heat exchanger or a heat um, heating something. No, what I want to be looking for is a, a heat exchanger, the large variety. We we do we have one. We have one over here that is actually connecting up some of these guys, but these i don't know let's see we could probably do with the heat exchanger next to the airport over here because the airport definitely needs some heating um, but we could push it out a little bit over there maybe pick up all of this stuff oh hang on we've got a heat exchanger over here that i've already built <laughs> i just need to bring in some uh, some pipes okay we'll have to have a look at that Okay, we'll have to have a look at that. Okay, so let's uh, let's have a look at what we'll do for our heating pipes towards um, towards this facility. I believe this facility will at least cover a lot. What does it actually cover? It does cover most of this, so that will help us. Um, that will help us. That will definitely help us. Let's quickly see. What I want to do is I want to try and make this um, as kind of. Um, as nice as possible. So what we need to, one of the things that I wanted to do is potentially provide a drop off for, um, from a storage perspective, uh, this one, like the small aggregate storage. So the idea was that we'll be able to provide a small aggregate storage over here somewhere. All right, that, that will um, generally work. So let's see. So if we do a small aggregate storage that way, and we'll do um, an unloading station, loading, unloading station. Let's just have a quick look. If we go to train station aggregate, train aggregate unloading. The idea was that we could potentially s uh, move something like this in here, or alternatively on the other side, Yeah, so this is where it's going to have to go in the end. 
if we wanted to do that. On this side, we don't want to. We don't want to um, directly in there, though. It's really just not going to squeeze. Just not going to squeeze. We need. We need more space. So ultimately, it'll have to go in. Uh, actually, somewhere over here could be could be quite good if we just uh, try and do a little something like this. So let's find its location. So we'll do that. Like so. We're not going to build it now. We won't connect it onto roads and stuff. The other one we wanted to do was get the aggregate um, storage. Small aggregate storage is going to be fine. Somewhere like this. Yeah, it does not want to... It does not want to play ball, guys. If we do... Uh, this kind of thing. Now, let's quickly have a look about this conveyor thing. So it just doesn't want to go over the top here, does it? So what we could do is we could probably find ourselves one of these modded ones. Conveyors, conveyor pipe station, something like this guy. Yep, it's gonna have to be that one. So let's uh, let's do let's let's do the oh actually we need to just bear in mind oh, 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 oh. it actually works this way yeah so let's do this where it's uh, pretty short so if we do that kind of set up goes up pretty heavily like that so let's just see about the rail quickly not gonna build this now but the idea is that yeah we can in fact also do um, we can also do that so that that should be fine there we go we're gonna we're gonna leave all of that in place that way and then we're gonna start doing our our heating pipe so heating pipe Let's, um, and I want to make sure that we'll do. So something like that, so that we'll have room for some roads. All right, underneath it and up and over again. There we go, and then we'll try and run it fairly straight over here. So that'll go straight across the road there. Over the highway. Okay, so up there, and then, yeah, and then we'll just um, continue this one up to about there somewhere. Okay, now the question is, will we make it? I think... I feel we will. It's uh, ooh, ooh, that's a little bit too. Oh man, that's that's awesome. Do something like that. And then tie that in. How does that go? That is uh, is looking pretty good. I I must say that's a that's a much tidier tidier setup. Let's go ahead and fund that and see about getting that built so that we can uh, um, use a little bit more of our heating potential over here. Excellent. How is this going? Is this done? Oh man, that's so close. Sixty eight tons of um, asphalt. And to be honest, we also need a little bit more along the line is this built no that's not built we need we need an additional maybe a, a, another service service thing what is it what is it called road vehicles depot no technical services technical services will provide a technical services spot uh, right over here next to the train station 
What happened over there? Can I... Let's demolish that one and see. Is that... Ooh. That's not great. Anyway, technical services over here. Okay, technical services, and we don't need anything apart from a road connection point here. Let's tie that one in there. We'll get that built, so now hopefully that construction can be underway. What's going on over here with our construction? Is our bridge done? Our bridge is done. And our rail? Rail is getting there, slowly. Slowly. The rest is slowly, slowly getting, everything slowly getting done. Lots of work still needs to be done over here. Still need gravel and all these kind of things. Yeah, we need a big, a big gravel setup. Okay, with all of that in place, what's going on over here? Everybody's got some food going on for them, meats and stuff. That's not, that's bad. That's not, not bad at all. Not bad at all. And over here, we've been building... Yeah, it's gravel. Gravel is a dilemma for us. So we need more um, gravel. Let's just see what's our gravel situation. Yeah, we're out of gravel. Um, this is constantly working at a pretty rapid pace. It's just about... Why are you not picking up? Ah, I see. You didn't have your vehicle ready there. So let's... So yeah, every time they have to go and fill up, yeah, we don't get these guys come in empty a fair bit. That's uh, yeah, that's done. It's another one filling in over here. Yeah, so it's really our gravel situation isn't uh, is not ideal. But it's just a lot of gravel uh, uh, that's required every now and again. Yeah, this construction is underway. That construction is done. So this construction can get can get moving. Okay, let's see. I uh, probably need another kindergarten over here. So let's just get the standard vanilla kindergarten. Um, yeah, it's probably going to have to go in right over there. Let's make sure to tie it in. Yeah, in the end that uh, was a requirement. So let's make sure to tie that one in over there so we can get the kindergarten up and running too. Nice. More kindergartens. More kindergartens. Yeah, I'm going to leave this area open just so that we have it ready for an additional warehouse should we need it. And then this guy. How far are you guys? 43 tons. It's really getting close. It's getting very close. It's getting very close. I believe at the end of this episode we will have that ready to go. Um, we've, we've finished off this. So now it's the roundabout being constructed over here. I'm quite happy with that. This is taking ages. Uh, now, at least we have the rolling underway now. So we should be able to get that done pretty quickly. Uh, we've got a train over here, probably filled up with with uh, with chemicals. Yeah, we're kind of using the chemicals from the train instead. You should actually have an ability to just park the train there and use the train as a warehouse. Uh, not that that's an effective use of trains though. This is filled up with UF6 uh, um, and it's slowly producing the others. How many people are actually working here? A fair number actually, a fair number, but we don't have anybody driving here. And this is working at a pretty reasonable pace also. Nice, nice. Lots of lots of steel available. It's, it's looking good. It's really looking good. Look at all of this. None of this is actually being plowed. That's a strange one. Oh, let's quickly have a look at what's currently being built from a, from a vehicle perspective. Uh, for the refrigerator trucks are being built, but we haven't seen any of them in quite a while. Let's move. Uh, well, we'll leave those there. They can all drive at least, even though it'll be slow. They can all drive. Let's move this one over here. Just get that one to uh, join the mix over there. These are under construction. It'll be good if we can get them done. Um... We're slowly getting all of this up. Oh, we've got some work underway over here. That'll take some time because, uh, yeah, let's face it, we're not we're not um, able to um, do the construction really quickly at the moment. Oh, this is actually moving a little bit. Not bad. Uh, a lot of asphalt arriving over there. How about over here? 29 tons. So, yes, asphalt is, in fact, arriving. 
um, fairly regularly, it seems. So we should be fairly close. Uh, it'll probably need a bit of rolling um, once it's done, too. Some more technical services in this area, maybe some technical services elsewhere. How's this going? Is this assigned to construction? Let's just see what's going on here. But Irinsky, let's just see, what are we missing? We're missing workers. Irinsky construction workers. Let's grab the Irinsky construction workers, please. Uh, we've got all the other components here. We just need construction workers. So once the Irinsky construction workers, in fact, arrives, that should, um, should do its thing. Yeah, that's not bad. That's not bad. Uh, a bit of extra source of heating from, uh, from here should be really good for us. Should be really good. Lots of stuff under construction, but yes. And how's our population going? Uh, we are seeing more births than deaths. We're over 27,000 yet again, which is a, a good number. I wouldn't mind seeing us up at the 30 mark. Uh, but we are taking it fairly slow because this airport construction is tremendous. It takes ages to get done. Uh, what we can and should do is we should find a way to start the construction of this. <clears throat> of this. So let's uh, let's get our little pathway up and running. So this one here and in there, that's the one. So let's uh, get ready for construction over there uh, so that that can get constructed. This runs through here though. We won't be able, unless we Unless we run this as a two-way, it'll be a little bit of a challenge. Uh, it can't go out into this side, though. So we may have to... I don't know if we can do anything better than that. Wow, I, this little section here is going to be really problematic. Unless we... Oh no, we've got a road through here. Yeah, so what I'm thinking, I'm going to move some of these things. Let's move some of this. Uh, um, some of these uh, these things. So let's, I'm going to move these two quickly. Let's pause it while we do it. Uh, then what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a switch type thing over here. There we go. And what we'll do is we'll put a mixed... Mixed signal over there. Love myself a good mixed signal. Uh, and this one will just, I think this is just gonna be bi-directional over there. So we'll do that, we'll switch that on. I believe this will be able to quickly build these two sections for us. Oh, there we go. Found it. Oh crap. That's gonna block, isn't it? Up to about there. Uh, in order to get this to work, we may need another semaphore over there. Nice, it's gonna squeeze in. Excellent, that's gonna be quite helpful. Nice, I think that's actually gonna work quite well. That means we can actually start running trams um, to the other side. We don't have any trains running through this section, so that's actually quite helpful. We're gonna put the electric poles. So that one's done, now the other one, it does it really quickly. Nice, and it's done. So now it means that we can, in fact, run a tram out over that way and come back. Yeah, that would work. So if we can get that built, it would, would, would help. How's this going? 17 tons. That's like two more trucks full of asphalt. That's what we're after, two more trucks of asphalt and when we're done. How's this going? Uh, this is the poles now. We should be very close here. This section is waiting on gravel. So yeah, it does. it is taking time. The train line is going, not too bad. Okay, let's get down here and see what's going on. 
How's our numbers here? The numbers here are not too bad. Electronics are looking good. Plastics looking, well, electronics could be better. Plastics aren't too bad. Electronic components are good. Clothes, lots of clothes. Food is fine. Chemicals is awesome. Can't, uh, can't do, can't need more than that. Um, lots of plastics. Do we, are we storing plastics here? We are in fact storing plastics here. So all of that's going on. Uh, what is going on here? Operating without issues. Operating, can't export plastics. This one, missing steel? What are we, pro electronic components, missing steel. So we're not, ah, we're not delivering steel here anymore. So what I'm, I'm kind of tempted to have these guys bring in some steel this way that we're not bringing in by train. This one is taking steel. Oh, it's taking the steel over there though. Hmm. Hmm, 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 hmm. Now, the question is, do I grab a couple of open holes over here? Let's just uh, move these one or two open holes that way. Oh, these things are done. Well, two of them are. And we'll move that one over. And then what I'll do is I'm just going to say, guys, come and grab, go and grab, remember to grab us some steel um, out over here. Okay, is that a closer steel facility? Not really. Uh, we, we need to set up better steel, to be honest, and make sure to bring it off, um, drop it off over here. So uh, pick up steel, unload, unload steel. Ooh. Let's uh, hang on till we get a vehicle over there. I don't want a lot of stuff to be dropped off there that we don't need there. We've got that. So now you can pick up steel and you can... Oh, hang on. That's not what we want. Ironski Steel Reserve. This isn't the one. This is not the one. That's my mistake. That's my mistake. Uh, where are we? Let's grab that guy and we'll drop him off over here instead. There we go. Go, go nuts. Unload steel over there. Thanks. Uh, maybe you just get yourself to like 40 per... Uh, is this limited though? Uh, yeah, so 30% of that, that's fine. Let's, let's, let's just get some steel going on over there. So a couple of trucks of steel should be able to give us enough steel for the electronic components work that we are doing in that area. How is my roads going? My roads are not moving. This is a slow, slow and steady crawl. Okay, now let's get some of these guys out over here. What is this under construction? No mechanical, oh, we're out of mechanical components. That's the one. We really use it very sparingly. <laughs> let's just get these guys out over here. So move that one over. Uh, what? Why are you part? What is that? It's got two vehicles on it? Whoa, 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 whoa. Is this vehicle still running? Oh, it picked them up ages ago. It's running this line. Ooh, cancel the line. Let's just go over here. Just come in over here. Completely uh, did not think about that. And what we'll do is we'll erase it from the line. So you now have a depot to go to. So please come and make your way to the depot. Let's see. It's going to throw a turn there. Yeah, good stuff. Good stuff. You forgot we still had that vehicle. Now let's move some of these guys. Yeah, so mechanical components have stopped construction for us over here. And we'll move that one. Oh, well, anyway, go do that one then. Is it the end of winter? Uh, close to, close to 40 million. 40 million, looking good, looking good. What's going on with this pipe? Why is this pipe not being constructed? Um, it is being constructed. We are um, in need of a... What? Where's my construction workers? Did I not do it? 
Whoever can come and assist. Let's just get everybody to come and assist. We're through winter and we couldn't finish that. This is done? No. It's not done. Is it being rolled? It needs a lot more people. Ah, here comes the rollers. <laughs> Tiny little uh, roller uh, rolling this massive runway. But we are really close to this. So much of this stuff is not getting done. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to pay for this guy. Pay for that and get this under construction straight away. Can we get MV guys to come in over here? MV. MV construction workers and MV equipment. Bring all of those guys in. And get MV to come and uh, quickly build uh, this guy for us. Hopefully that can can do the trick. Um, so no more, um, most of our construction vehicles are not stuck on this thing anymore, which is really helpful. So now they should be out here working, doing their thing. What's going on with this? We still need some work being done over here. Lots of uh, little bits and pieces that's taking a long time to get done. That's done, that's done. Uh, we should have construction vehicles coming out here to do this, right? Is this under construction? Should be. Uh, this is not under... Oh, because that's... Uh, hang on. That's not been assigned. Let's just see. Do we have a construction vehicle? Yeah, yeah, we have one. So they are doing their thing. Okay, this is still not... Um, still under construction, yeah. It's just missing a lot of construction workers. Can I get MV construction workers to come in over here also? MV construction workers, we'll grab them to come and come and support um, the operation here. Okay, good stuff. We are pretty much at the end of the episode, guys. I know there's not a lot that's happened. I would really like us to finish this guy off. A thousand more work days and then the airport will be done. This is filled up with everything we need. What we don't have over here is um, is power. Let's quickly see about where we're going to get power from for uh, for the airport. At the moment, this is not powered. This, I think, is powered. So that one needs to be powered. So what will we do? Let's let's find ourselves. Uh, we need a we need at least one of these guys somewhere over here. So if we do that, okay, we'll do that. Uh, we'll do that as a starting point. Um, I'm just going to connect it with the standard, not the not the um, the street light variety. We'll get that underway. To be honest, what I'll do is I'll just pay for that. There's a lot of these things that's taking ages. So we'll get the guys to come and build this while we figure out where this is going. So this guy. What level of uh, power consumption? Not a lot. So we could potentially split this one off. This thing should now be doing the heating thing. Nice. Doing the heating thing. So let's quickly have a look. Is our heating situation over here? Ah, it's pretty good, actually. Pretty good. So it's not the end of the world there. Now, let's see. Can we do a little splitter off of this? So medium voltage switch in this location would actually work would actually work. Let's pause the game. Let's get rid of that guy. We'll get our medium voltage switch. Come on. There we go. Tie that one in. I'm going I'm just going to I'm honestly just going to going to do it. Just going to do it. There's a lot of little things that we just need to sort out. I uh, need to no 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 medium voltage medium voltage. Let's um tie that one in there. Pay for that. Get us the uh, well. Let's just do all all of this. Okay, now <clears throat> power cable across here. That's fine. And what we'll do is we'll run it up here, and then we'll run it across there so as to not be uh, 
too imposing on, on the airport. There we go, and I'll just pay for it. There we go. Okay, now with that done, this little section needs to be built. I'm going to pay for that too. Yeah, guys, I know, I know. I just, I, some of these things, I, I, if I have to wait an entire episode for certain things to be done, it just, it gets, it gets, uh, it goes over the top, really. So now there's 70,000 for this to be done. I'm going to pay for it, man. I'm going to pay for it, man. Okay, I'm going to do it. Oh, this is uh, this is going along nicely. The um, <coughs> the bowling alley is uh, is ready for action. These things are under construction, all looking pretty good, really. Um, anybody complaining about food over here? Meat a little bit, but not food. Not food. Over here, food? Nah, not food. A lot of people can't find a church and stuff like that, which is okay. Not the end of the world, this guy... Buildings without power supply? Oh, yeah, uh, that uh, makes sense. It makes sense. Now it should be okay. There we go. One citizen couldn't get food. That's done, that's done. This should be powered. Awesomeness. Awesomeness, how far is this? <clears throat> 800, I'm just gonna pay for it. I'm just gonna finish off. It's just rolling the last piece. We built this entire airport ourselves. I'm just getting a little bit okay let's buy let's buy a plane while we wait and see if we can't do a little bit more so I want to procure a plane I can't do it anywhere else but here so cargo only passenger and cargo uh, or show all which gives me so we've got uh, AN2 um, we've got this guy which is 2 million the AN2 is pretty cheap and then what do we have over here? That's a cargo, that's a big one. And you've got the Yak 42. The Yak 42 takes 120 passengers. This one takes 164 and that one takes 12. I don't know if the 12 is gonna work really well for us. What I'd rather do is let's get one of these guys, the Yaks, 1.3 million. We can quite easily accommodate that. <clears throat> so I'm gonna go ahead and grab that, that guy. So there we go, we've got our very first plane ready for action. We've got a Yak. There's our yak ready to go. The yak's gonna go and get us some uh, Western tourists. This is, uh, how much is this gonna cost us? I'm just gonna finish that one off. So there we go, finishing that off. The last 60,000 rubles or so worth of, um, uh, worth of labor is, has been done that. Okay, now, this guy, you are gonna go and Go to the Boroslav Airport Terminal, and then you are gonna go to uh, the Western countries, and you're gonna do get in, get out. I think that's gonna be just fine. So let's start out. Let's start it and see what's going on. There we go, guys. There we go, and let's click this one and just see. It's probably gonna fill up its fuel. Yeah, there we go, filling up with the fuel. That's good. That's really good. There we go. Now this is our very first takeoff. Let's let's uh, let's do this. Oh, actually, let's take a ride, and that's going to be kind of the last thing we do. So there we go. There goes our there goes our very first. Let's do that, and I'm going to switch that off. So guys, this is the very first takeoff from the brand new airport in Irinsky. Look at that. Probably need to clear the trees out a little bit. Oh, look at that. Into the wild blue yonder. Nice. It's a pretty quick one. Oh, through the snow and the weather. Heading towards the western countries. Awesome. Crossing the border. Oh, lots of water out there. <laughs> a little weird. Anyway, coming back. I'm assuming it'll come back. Or we're just going to drop it now. Is that it? Oh, oh, we're moving. Is it coming back? We're not moving anymore. Oh, here it comes. Nice. Wow, look at that. The somewhat Soviet state of chaos. Oh, and springtime for the first Western tourists are arriving just in time for the spring. 
Uh, we probably don't have a bus for them because I don't think that uh, station is done yet. Oh, look at this maneuver. Look at that maneuver. Nice. And another. Here we go. And oh, landing gear out and arriving. We probably need a slip off um, somewhere over here. It's something we could. Is this going to turn around? No, luckily not. Now it's just going to taxi all the way out there. So guys, there we go, our very first flight. Let's quickly have a look. How many people do we have on here? We've got eight tourists only from uh, from like the, the Western Western states arriving at our airport. So let's just uh, clear that one off. They are arriving here. Is this thing built? No, this is still under construction. And to be honest, what I can do is I can just run this back and forth till all the way over there. I'm gonna build, pay for this, sorry guys. I'm gonna do a fair bit of stuff here. Get that done, pause the game just for a second. We'll quickly set up a tram um, and then we'll end this episode. Let me just set up one of these trams. Uh, we'll start with a line. We'll do that, we'll say new line. We'll rename it the tourist tram. We'll rename it the tourist tram like so. And now we'll assign a stop. I'm gonna do a stop here to pick up some workers. All right. Okay, then it's gonna slip off that way. Stop here and stop there. And then stop here again and then go out. Yeah, that's fine. We'll do that. Um, if we just, we'll just do the one tram. I think that's gonna be just fine. So we'll say everybody's loadable. So that's the one. So it's gonna do in, it's pop in there, do that, do that thing. That should work fairly well. So it's gonna pick up some workers out over here to help um, supplement this, this as well. So there we go, we've got the tourist tram. Now let's just get a tram to go and actually do that. Grab me one of these guys and we say, clear that one off and say set the line to be the tourist tram. There you go and go. Now, let's see, there we go, this guy should be moving. Let's quickly see the plane has stopped and is dropping off some tourists, so now it's going back. Tourists aren't able to go anywhere. Is that right? This building cannot be reached by any residential or factory buildings. There's no road or footpath. All right, so what we'll do, this guy, move everybody over here. Hey everybody, I don't think it's gonna work. It needs to be set that way when they, upon arrival. Anyway, it'll work, it'll work. I'm gonna see where my, uh, where this tram is. Here it comes, be my little tourist tram. Excellent, we've through the winter, uh, now that we've got our heating up and running over here. Possibly squeeze in trains in between here. This thing is too big. Gonna go up here. Yeah, there we go. Nice tourist tram next to the buildings. I like it. Let's quickly have a look. Uh, what's going on with uh, the signals over here? That needs to be a chain, please. Does it? Does it need to be a chain? Anyway. Gonna pick up uh, tons of people and some passengers. Wow. Nice. People going to the zoo, maybe. Let's uh, quickly follow this one through here, and that'll be the last thing we do. Okay, moving around there, dropping off some people. Nice, how many people left? No, oh, four workers left going to the other side. Is that for the, uh, anybody on here? No. So we've got the eight tourists here. Okay, hang on, what I'm gonna do. Do I need a bus? Okay, let's see if this guy arrives, what happens.
They've arrived. They're there. They're not moving through. Why not? Oh, where the workers should go. Ah, that's it. Go over here, guys. Tourists go over there. Nice. Yes, there we go. Twitter's arriving. Okay, okay, okay. Hang on. Where's my tram? Yeah, here we go. Here we go. Oh, there's a Twitter's on the tram. And... Nice. Nice. Okay, following this. Following this. There we go. There goes all the tourists to the various hotels. Excellent. Let's quickly pop in here and have a quick look. There we go. Dollars. We're racking up dollars, guys. We have Western tourists in our midst. Uh, they should all be able to walk here, right? Yeah, no problems. No problems. That's going really well. This is being rolled. Nice. Nice, guys. We have flight. We've achieved flight. Where is that plane? Anyway, there it comes back. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Um, it's been awesome. I'm, uh, I'm happy, so happy that we've got that up and running. Um, all of these other construction projects can now hopefully conclude. Um, we need to bring in some, some materials over here because everything's going to kind of stop. Uh, but anyway, that's it for this episode. If you've liked it, hit that like button. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.